everyone, this is Caitlin Klanuski here with Isabel Blanco. Today we're going to be working on some infield everyday drills. So the importance of infield everyday drills is you want to work on glove work and fundamentals. Specifically, a lot of athletes or infielders have a hard time tracking the ball all the way in and fielding the ball out in front of their body. So something that you'll see Isabel working on here is going to be keeping her eyes down and her chin down as she receives the ball out in front. You'll see as we progress the drill, we'll go from a baseline with no sort of cognitive element to it. Then we'll add our mind's eye reflex glasses to the mix to be able to work on her um, tracking the ball all the way in, add a little bit of difficulty there, and then finally we'll end it off with a think fast task. Good. That one wasn't. That was hard, soft. All right, so the deal with the mind's eye reflex glasses is it will be flashing on and off. So for a split second, she will have her vision completely blocked off. It is her responsibility to be able to make sure that she's tracking that ball from the second I roll it all the way into her hands despite the visual distraction. Ooh, I got you. <laughs> this is so much harder. Good. It's easy for you guys to breeze through your every days, every practice when you're just like partnered up and lots of days ago doing it. Now you really have to have some more intention. I really gotta lock in. Yeah, you should be locked in no matter what, with or without them. Way to lock in. Through it. Soft. Good. I need three more in a row, clean. Good. Good, now switch to your backhand. One more clean rep. Good, good job. Hey, way to adapt, especially going from, you know, easy right to you to the backhand. You struggle with the backhand, but then you were able to get it together once you slowed yourself down. Yeah. All right, so now that she did her baseline and then she did a second round with the glasses, this is now us taking the same reps again, just now without the glasses. Two more. How would you say now the difference without the glasses now? Um, I definitely have to focus a lot more. Like it helped me focus. Like before, like it was fine. I could see the ball, but now, like I'm a lot more like watching the ball in and going through the hops. So now we will be doing our infield everyday drills, and now in between reps of me rolling her balls, she'll, she'll be performing the Stroop task on our Think Fast app, where her responsibility is to keep her eyes up still as the ball is coming in and be able to see a word written in a different color ink. Her responsibility is to call out the color that the word is written in and not what the word says. So we're gonna use this as the primary task, fielding the ball. The secondary task is gonna be you calling out the color that the word is written in. How this applies to the field is a lot of time when the ball is hit to you, you'll tend to not go ball first and sometimes you'll peek up too early to see where the runner is and then you let that ball go. So this is working on you prioritizing the ball and then attending to that stimuli. Green. If you can, look up with your eyes, not your whole face. Blue. Yep, blue. Yellow. Short hops. Blue. All right, everybody, so we just finished up doing our infield everyday drills and adding a little bit more stress to the equation by using our mind's eye reflex glasses. Isabel, how do you feel? Um, the glasses definitely helped, like once I took them off, it was definitely a lot more frustrating doing it with it, like, you know, the lights turning on and off, but like once I took them off and started doing the drills again, like it definitely helped me see the balls better. And doing the drill with the calling out colors and doing both balls, like I have to do two things at once, so it's definitely, helping like field wise. So everybody, the Mind's Eye Reflex Glasses will be coming out for sale shortly, so be sure to stay posted. In the meantime, be sure to follow me on Instagram at mb one caitlin and I'll see you guys next time. Closed mouths don't get fed. If you want something, you gotta ask for it, or you gotta go get it. So if you wanted to know, hey coach, where are we going today? What do I need? Should I wear shorts? Should I wear my high socks? Should I pack an extra pair of socks? Open your mouth and ask me and I'll give you an answer. Okay. Yeah. Yes, coach. <laughs> yes, coach. <laughs>